Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a Sephora haul and these products are completely new to me. Um, I haven't tried any so... Oh wait, um, my bad. I re had to restock on my one size point me liner. You guys, I love this eyeliner so so much. Um, it's one of a kind. It's super black, super pigmented and I love the applicator. It's so precise. Patrick Starr knew what he was doing when he did that liner. So, um, okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and move on to what I got. And I picked up the Anastasia Brow Freeze. And I can't wait to try this on. I've been really um, focusing on my brows lately. I've been practicing, hoping to get, hoping to get satisfied with the way my brows look. I haven't um, waxed or I haven't threaded in a while since I haven't really been going out because of um, the whole COVID. So this is what the packaging looks like. It's so, so pretty, it's rose gold. And it's just a clear gel and I have to smell it. It doesn't smell like anything. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, it isn't, it's not as thin or thick. It's like in the middle. Okay, well, I can't wait to try it on. There's nothing like trying it on first. Okay, so moving on, um, I finally picked up Rare Beauty, you guys. I'm so excited. Um, I picked up the um, Luminizer. I'm reading, I'm reading the other language. I picked up the Positive Light Liquid Luminizer in the color Flaunt. And I can't wait to try this on. I've never tried on any cream highlighters before. And this is what it looks like i love the packaging so so much um i'm gonna go ahead and swatch this wow i'm really excited to try out new things i'm, I'm actually more um i've been more open to trying out new things so yeah i'm uh, moving on i I went ahead and I got the Melting Blush and I got in the color Nearly Apricot and I'm going to show you guys Selena Gomez came out and her team came out with the cutest packaging look at this rose pink color and it's so cute like it's so small and look at this this is the color I got it's so pretty I can't wait I'm not going to swatch this one I'm going to wait till I um Put it on but i can't wait to try on uh cream products i've never tried cream products before either so i can't wait to like just um try it on and then moving on i got a concealer and this concealer i'm gonna have to return it i got in the color 340c and this one i'm for sure returning because it is not my shade i completely messed up but look at the packaging it's so cute and i really did mess up with the shade i mean i did guess on i was guessing online it was kind of you know what i no it's definitely not what i was aiming for i went two sheets lighter than because i know that you match the foundation um to the concealer just like fenty so that's what I had that's what I went ahead and I did, but then I went two shades lighter just because I like a more bright um effect underneath my eye. And you guys I messed up. It's the wrong shade. So I'm gonna go and return it. No biggie. <laughs> so now for foundation, this is a foundation I got. I got let me go ahead and read it. Le Le oh, I keep reading the wrong language, like if I could. So this is a liquid touch weightless foundation and I got in the color 360W. 360W. And I think this is gonna be my color. Definitely my color. Oh, I feel so liquidy. I'm not used to liquidy foundations. I think the foundations. Oh my god, it's coming off. 
Ooh. I hope that's a good thing. I'm not used to um, liquidy foundations. All the foundations I've tried are thicker, which I don't mind. <clears throat> which I don't mind. But um, I like I said, I'm open to trying out new things now, and this is very liquidy and. I love just trying out new things because then I find that I love them and I keep trying out new things so oh my god I kept saying new things my bad so I did get the liquid touch multitasking sponge and it's so lightweight but it's a sponge and this is what it looks like oh my god it's like kind of really rough <clears throat> my bad. I don't know why my throat is getting blood. So it's really, um, it's really rough and it has a lot of texture on it, but, um, there's nothing I'm trying it on, so. Yes! And then, I got the eyeshadow. I wanted to get everything matching, so I, I matched everything, so I got Nearly Apricot as well. Girl! <clears throat> I don't have water here, so I'm gonna wait. So I did get the nearly apricot and hold on, I need water. So I also got the stay, Vul stay vulnerable liquid eyeshadow and I wanted to match everything so I got nearly apricot as well. And I can't wait to you know what? I'm gonna be doing a try-on of all rare beauties, so I'm gonna go ahead and um just watch them for now and then I'm just gonna go over everything but I'm gonna do a video on that I just really wanted to share with you guys what I got from Sephora lately and this is it this is the eyeshadow the cream eyeshadow I've never cream liquid eyeshadow my bad um, I've never tried on liquid eyeshadows either so I'm new to everything so I'm gonna have to really just practice and um, see how I could get better applying everything because I know I'm not gonna be an expert. Well, I'm not an expert with makeup, but I know a few things. <laughs> so I did get the glossy lip balm as well and I got the same color, Nearly Apricot. And like I said, I am gonna do um, another video on a rare beauty so but I'm gonna be trying on everything but I do have to go and change that concealer first okay this one you're not gonna be able to see it especially with like so this is the nearly apricot and this is the shade and this is the applicator so I'm gonna be doing a, like I said a video on all this so yeah, I have to go return the concealer because it's totally not my color. So, have you guys um, bought anything from Rare Beauty? Comment down below and let me know. And how do you like it? Like, And are you guys open to trying out new things? Let me know. So this is pretty much all the swatches that I did. I'm not an expert with swatches either. That's pretty much it for this video, you guys. Um, if you do... If you did like my rookie self um, going over this Sephora haul, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and comment down something sweet down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!